गुड इवनिंग फ्रेंड्स स्टार्ट करोसन अंडर इंसुलेशन डेस्क्रिप्शन ऑफ डैमेज करोसन और पाइपिंग प्रेशर वेसल्स एंड स्ट्रक्चरल कंपोनेंट्स रिजल्टिंग फ्रॉम वाटर ट्रैप्ड अंडर इंसुलेशन और फायर प्रूफिंग इफेक्टेड मेटेरियल्स कार्बन स्टील लो एल स्टील थ्री हंड्रेड सीरीज एस एस फोर हंड्रेड सीरीज एस एस एंड डिप्लेक्स स्टेनलेस स्टील क्रिटिकल फैक्टर्स टेम्परेचर ड्यूरेशन टेम्परेचर ड्यूरेशन ऑफ वेटिंग डिजाइन ऑफ इंसुलेशन सिस्टम इंसुलेशन टाइप एनवेमेंटल एनवेमेंट एंड क्रिटिकल फैक्टर्स करोजन रेट्स इंक्रीज विथ इंक्रीजिंग मेटल टेम्परेचर अप टू द पॉइंट वेद वाटर एबापोरेट्स क्विकली वेल वाटर बॉयल्स और स्टीम्स ऑफ एब द बॉइलिंग पॉइंट टू ट्वेल्व डिग्रीज फॉर नाइट हंड्रेड डिग्री सेंटीग्रेड डजेंट डू सो इंस्टेंटेनियसली इट टेक्स सम अमाउंट ऑफ टाइम ऑफ वाटर टू कूल बॉयल ऑफ एंड वेट इंसुलेशन और ड्राई आउट ड्यूरिंग दिस टाइम द मेटल इज करोडिंग द हायर द टेम्परेचर एब द बॉइलिंग पॉइंट द फास्टर द वाटर विल एबापोरेट एंड इंसुलेशन विल ड्राई आउट हाई वर विद द हाई एन ऑफ रेट ऑफ वेटिंग एंड रिप्लेसमेंट रिप्लेनिशमेंट ऑफ वाटर इन द weight insulation cui can occur <coughs> on equipment operating at very virtually any temperature or practical concern in refining in most situation and as a practical matter refiner generally focus their cui management effects on insulated carbon steel low alloy steel in 400 series ss equipment operating between 10 degrees fahrenheit to 350 degrees fahrenheit from 300 series ss where chlorine ssc is the concern refiner generally focus on the temperature range of 150 degrees fahrenheit to 350 degrees fahrenheit for duplex stainless steel where chlorine ssc is concerned refines generally focus on the temperature range of 280 degrees fahrenheit to 350 degrees fahrenheit poor design or installation of insulation system that allow water to become trapped will increase you increase insulating material that work weak moisture and can hold water and be more prone to causing extensive cui the water dew point tends to condense damage is aggravated by contaminants that may be leached out of the insulation such as chlorides plants located in the area with high annual rainfall of warmer marine locations are more prone to cui than plants located in cool and dry or warm and dry locations environments that provide airborne contaminants such as chlorides from marine environment or cooling tower dripped or so2 from stack emission can isolate corrosion affected units or equipments all insulated piping and equipment are susceptible to cui under the conditions noted above even piping and equipment the insulation system appears to be in good condition and no visual signs of corrosion present cui can be found on equipment with damaged insulation insulation jacketing vapor barriers weather proof weather proofing or mosaic mastic or where caulking has 
hardened, separated, or is missing. The first few feet of a horizontal pipe run adjacent to the bottom of a vertical run. Piping or equipment with damaged and leaking steam tracing is susceptible. The equipment designed with insulation support rings welded directly to the vessel wall. With no stand-up can be susceptible, particularly around the ladder and platform clips, lifting locks, nozzles, and stiffener rings. Their piping and equipment have been coated beneath the insulation localized UI can still occur, but the coating has deteriorated or been damaged. The appearance of morphology of damage. 300 series SS are selected to SSE if chloride are present, while the duplex stainless steel are less susceptible to SSE failure. They have occurred in duplex stainless steel due to CUI. 300 series SS and duplex stainless steel are sub subjected to pitting and crevice corrosion. Prevention mitigation. Since most construction materials used in refining are susceptible to CUI damage, Mitigation is the best achieved by applying an appropriate coating to the equipment prior to insulating. High quality immersion resistance non-metallic coatings properly applied to the surface to be insulated can provide long-term protection. Flame spread aluminum coatings have been used on carbon steels. The coating corroded corrodes differentially by galvanic action thereby protecting the base metal. The aluminum foil wrapped on the stainless steel piping and the equipment beneath the insulation can provide an effective barrier, partly due to the galvanic effect of the aluminum is preventing chlorine SSC in stainless steel. Low chloride insulation should be used on 300 series SS to minimize the potential for pitting and chlorine SSC. Some manufacturers supply insulation certified to the low chloride. Thermal insulation material can be tested for HTMC 871 to evaluate chloride content and or ensure it satisfies a specified limit. Inspection and monitoring. An effective way to find CUI damage to complete removal of insulation and inspection for damage using VT, UT and or a pit case is applicable for the for determining remaining thickness or PT to examine the external chlorine SSC of osmotic stainless steel. Non-invasive commercially available methods can be used to identify either wet insulation or CY damage under the insulation without removing the insulation. However, these methods should be expect should not be expected to find 100% damage. Each of these methods are discussed in API 583, including advantages and disadvantages for which most of the screening techniques that may be helped identify where there is a higher probability of CY damage and where insulation stripping may be needed to further assess and quantify the damage. The method include but may not be limited to GWT, guided wave technology, PRT, PEC, neutron backscatter for the identifying wet insulation and infrared thermography imaging for identifying wet insulation. The piping T in a hundred
thousand psi ethylene in nine before insulation removed. Close up of the T in figure three twenty one dash one after insulation removed. CY of thirty inch carbon steel butadiene line showing highly localized corrosion that could only be found by stripping the entire line. Note point two five inch six point five mm diameter hole. Eight arrow. CY eight. Okay. Nozzle on the bottom head of a pressure vessel. CY of a nozzle on the top head of pressure vessel. CY of a vessel wall. Note the leak at the air. Uh, CY of a vessel wall. Note the leak at the CY of attachment supports and on the vessel head. CY of a carbon steel level bridle. Level bridle.
erosion erosion corrosion the subject cover a wide range of situations of material material loss from flowing solid particles alone or in a liquid or vapor stream physically abrading the material to material loss accelerated by the flow of corrosive liquid or vapor possibly combined with the velocity associated removal of protective film or scale erosion is the mechanical removal of surface material as the result of relative movement of between or impact from solids liquid vapor or any combination thereof it is typically found in surface where solids are in entrained in liquid or vapor stream such as slurries and fluidized solid in refining with the exception of water droplets on steam system it is unlikely that any flowing liquid or liquid impregnant without entertained solid would be able to erode typical materials of construction without also being a corrosion component present the same can be said for gases with the possible exception of steam coating however see cavitation 3.16 erosion corrosion is description of the damage that occurs when particle erosion and or high flow velocity contributes to corrosion by removing protective films or scales or otherwise accelerating the corrosion rate this is also called velocity assisted corrosion in most refinery erosion corrosion situation corrosion is the dominant consideration affected material all metals were mostly carbon steel and copper alloys in refining refractories are also affected most common affected are materials without two passivity where the corrosion rate is limited by protective corrosion layer or inhibit inhibitive film critical factors with solid particle mechanical erosion metal loss rates will depend on the velocity of number of in impacting particles the low concentration particle versus slurry as well as size shape hardness and density of the impacting particle the hardness of the material subjected to erosion and the angle of impact softer alloys such as copper aluminum alloys that are easily worn worn from mechanical damage may be subjected to severe metal loss under high velocity condition increasing pipe thickness schedule will decrease the id and increase the flow velocity potentially increasing the corrosion rate in most cases the more corrosive environment is the particular material is greater will be the erosion corrosion effect especially where erosion effect damage the stability of the protection film scale or other barrier upon which the metal depend for its corrosion resistance any factors that any factors that contribute to an increase in corrosivity of the environment such as temperature ph etc can increase susceptibility to erosion corrosion metal loss affected units of equipment all types of equipment exposed to moving fluids and or catalyst are subjected to erosion erosion corrosion this includes piping bands elbows tees and reducers piping system downstream and let down balls and block balls pump blower propellers impellers agitators vessels with agitators heat exchanger tubing measuring device orifices turbine blades nozzles ducts and vapor lines scrapers cutters and wear plates crude and vacuum unit piping and vessel exposed to naphthenic acids in some crude oils may suffer severe erosion corrosion metal loss depending on the temperature velocity sulfur content and naphthalenic acid content appearance or morphology damage erosion erosion corrosion are typically characterized by localized loss in thickness in form of grooves gullies waves rounded holes valleys 
or simply a greater amount of thinning in localized area, which is outer radius of piping elbow. These losses often exhibit to directional pattern. Liquid lines containing particular low velocity around 5 FES, 1.5 meters per second can allow solids to tumble to the bottom and causes erosion, erosion, corrosion in the six o'clock position. Prevention mitigation, change shape, geometry, and material can help mitigate erosion, erosion, corrosion. Examples include increasing the pipe diameter to reduce velocity streaming bends to reduce imprisonment and inducing replaceable imprisonment baffles. Improved resistance to mechanical erosion is usually achieved by increasing component hardness using hard alloy hardening, hard facing or surface hardening treatment, erosion resistance refractories in cy cyclones and side valves are successfully resisted erosion. Erosion corrosion is based mitigated by using more corrosion resistance alloys and or altering the process environment to reduce corrosivity by deaeration, condensate injection or by addition of inhibitors as applicable. Heat exchanger utilize imprisonment plates or occasionally tube to ferrules to minimize erosion corrosion problems. Inspection and monitoring. Manual UT grids or automated scans can be used to determine the extent of erosion susceptible areas such so as change in direction, change in diameter, or other turbulent areas, randomly placed point UT readings may not be effective. They are not placed as the location of potential susceptibility. Profilatic can be used to detect areas of erosion, but may not be able to determine the actual remaining wall thickness. UT thickness is normally used as a follow-up technique to quantify wall loss. GWT can be used as screening technique. Infrared thermography scans can be used on stream on stream to detect refractory degradation potentially due to erosion. Specialized coupons can be used to determine the erosion is a potential concern. Typical erosion corrosion rates in seawater MPY reference to 9010 CUNI. Tidal current one, so sixteen. Erosion corrosion of a one one point two five chrome half moly three hundred LV volt flange on FCC and a catalyst withdrawal line. Erosion of a 8 chrome 1 moly cooker return, return band as a result of high stream air decoking velocity. Erosion corrosion at STM A48 class 30 cast iron impeller the water pump. Thank you, gentlemen. We'll stop here.